it's a spooky, it's a poppy, it's a spooky little spoppy, it's a spooky, it's a poppy, it's a spooky. Power on! Hello, welcome back. I'm currently being attacked by um, skelly mins. I don't think we're actually going to do that as power off because this is like the end of the episode, so. <laughs> Ooh, two back to back, awesome headshots. Do you think if people ask you this, you'd be willing to sit down and do a full play group? Me, probably. We have to finish this, this, this up. Is, this first, is pretty yeah. fun. Yeah. Oh, this could be one of those games where there's a uh, two season game. So you can either perch your soul of infection or suck your soul dry. You can be good or evil. Perch your soul of infection. If you are evil, it makes the game hard. If you are good, uh, you get you get good powers, but, um, yeah. Evil doesn't give you any powers? They both do, but evil makes the guys that you're about to interact with shoot you on a regular basis. <laughs> oh, okay, so I can look at the charts. Yes. Blood Frenzy adds a supernatural You can get a mix of boost. Both. Uh, turn the turn power. I, I assume that it gets better as you go on. Yes. So the reason why you should always do good for the first one, for anybody who wants to know, is silver bullets like super fucking important. It's super powerful. And then as you go on, you you should. There's one specific moment you get to make a choice. Don't be bad in that moment, because if you are bad, um, they will shoot you, and it makes the level harder. Blood frenzy, the blood power adds a thing to you. Oh. Turn, the turn power uh, makes slaves your enemies. And it makes slaves of your enemies and turns them against each other. Person. I believe black okay. shroud. Ba black shroud. Black shroud of words armor. Yeah, that is loud, isn't it? <laughs> Soul stealer, I think, is like the equivalent of leeching off life. See, I believe they're all basically the same power, except you just get it in different... Orders? Yeah, different orders. I think you have to hit R2 to activate your power. Oh, fuck. Just hit every button again. Sorry, I forgot how to jump for a moment there. Okay, okay. Let me see what, what the fucking booklet Isn't that nice having a booklet? It is. Uh, yeah. Strategy guides were dope. Uh, game control is a 6. L2 cycles powers. R2 button activates the power. You are welcome. Oh, so they're one-shot kills, basically. Yeah. Okay. It does significantly more damage. With things like the oozers and the banshees, I think it's like two or three shots. It does a lot more damage, but like a significant amount. Of and when you've got a full shield, uh, every blood clot you absorb uh, powers up your time. Okay, I'm trying to be more precise with my shots. There we go. Yep. Because if I'm aiming for the head, that, that'll make this game a lot easier. Why does this sound like Scooby-Doo Monsters Unleashed? It is. Yo! Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Oops. I don't plan Spookfest completely, but I did kind of plan uh, Majora's, not Majora's Mask, Dark Watch a little bit. Uh, like last year and the year before that, I was like, yeah. oh, I want to do Dark Watch. And then new games would fucking come out. I'd be like, fuck, I gotta do that. Because <laughs> Resident Evil 8 dropped this year, we were going to do that. But I was like, nah, this is the year we just chill out. We can play Resident Evil any time of the year. It does not have to specifically be Spook Fest. Fuck nice. off! That took a lot of shots to get you in the head, but okay. <laughs> My sisters. I'm a scrub. You can use silver bullet now. And scrub is a man who can't kill no banshee. Here in the passenger side of his best friend's ride, trying to holler at me. 
I don't want a banshee. A banshee's a woman who can't get no love from me. Screaming on the passenger side of my best friend's ride. I oh, fuck off. I will admit that them coming up to you like this is kind of creepy. It is spooky a little bit. This game is a good mixture of spooky and uh... It's like gothic horror-ish. Yes. Very cool, I like it. Ah oh, shit. Um... One of the, the cool games in the PS2 era. It's a gem. A diamond in the rough. A diamond in the rough. How did Silent Hill get more games than this? Right? <laughs> There's a lot of really shitty fucking Silent Hill games. There's three, exactly three good Silent Hill games out of 12. That is really not good. <laughs> that is a very bad ratio. Don't say that. The, the, um, the Twitter lords will come after you. Just for saying the word ratio. Oh, that's right. What does that even mean? Exactly? I don't fucking know. <laughs> I just see people comment ratio and then other people show up and go, uh, just say a slur. What? That's an increase. That's a, that's a bit of a shift. You may not have to deal with the user. Nice! Just let them come up to me and I can nice. clock them in the head. I just have to have enough room to let them approach me. And then I can just... <laughs> Gone. Oh, Are it's there? over there. That, that big green. What's up? Goopy goop. It, it, so turn around. That way. Yeah, they're coming at you right now. Oh, whoops. You have grenades, by the way. And they run away, which is super cool in my opinion. Oh, I think that's the user. Who's the user? Never mind, I was wrong. I would save the silver bullet until the oozer. Uh, just a reminder, silver bullet applies to every weapon in the game. Why aren't you being shot? Why is your hitbox so, like, small? That means you can use it with the crossbow. And there is, in fact, a rocket launcher in this game. They have such a small hitbox for their head. Why are you walking backwards so far? Because I'm trying to headshot him. But I'm like... Just you kill him. You don't have to headshot him specifically. I know I don't, but I want to. It's good to practice my headshots, you know? I haven't had to do this since Halo. There he is. Now you should kill the bullet. Oh, you can't get me. Oh, it whoops. Oh, you can't get me. What? <laughs> <laughs> I, I just leaned over. You should silver bullet, my guy. Okay, fine. Just lay into him. Okay. You did it. Bueno. <laughs> bueno. bueno dias. Bu Buenos dias, motherfucker. Buenos dias, Mandy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that. that <laughs> really it's such a, he's so good. No, it's where he, like, gets Mandy, like, pushes him in the street and runs over his hands, and he's like, ah! <laughs> okay. You your head off I'm back, you. bitches. Until then, I'm gonna kiss you. Puck her up. It's like I didn't want to be a, va a, a vampire. They didn't tell me I had to kiss demon lords. All right. Let's power off, folks. Power off. Kiss your kiss your nearest demon lord. Cassidy's dead. What? Do that cowboy voice again. What? Kiss your nearest uh, <laughs> demon lord. Next time you see a demon lord, peck him right on a kisser. Cassidy is dead. Lazarus lives. And your old damn nation is dead ahead. Oh, sorry. Whoa, Cassidy, hey. Cassidy is dead. Lazarus lives. And your only damn nation is dead ahead, alone, angry, and fighting for lust, blood, <laughs> battle, your way out of the haunted mine. 
You got this. Fuck him. You lost for blood. <laughs> <laughs> You're blessed. They're <Blah. laughs> Next day, my lord, you see, kiss him on either lips, either pair of lips. Doesn't matter which. Doesn't matter which pair of lips, as long as it's one of them. <laughs>